Up your skin material is absolutely brimming with beautiful texture and character, but before you start designing with it, it's really worth knowing a few things. Like for example, it is quite rigid and it can be quite bulky as well, especially when you're using it in decorations. So I'd love to share with you today some really gorgeous designs for when you're designing with fish skin. Now, keeping in mind the caution about mixing up this material with lots of other ones, I wanted to share these gorgeous shoes with you. Now you can see we've used the light blue fish skin, and this is the fish skin that's got a really great, just tiny little bit of silver on the edge of each of the scale imprints. It's really stunning, and really fits with that Chanel sort of water baby idea that came through a couple of years ago, and is still going on. Now, this one here has actually got a grey silk back ruffle on it. And I love this because it's really lovely and sculptural, it's in keeping with the tone of the rest of the shoe, and it makes for something that's a really great statement, but because of the palette that's being used, uh, can be quite casual as well. I also wanted to show you some of our fish skin material in practice that has multiple colours in the one skin. So these ballet flats here with the T-bar have been made out of our gold and silver fish skin. You can see that, I mean, the design is quite simple and it just lets all of that colour speak for itself. So that's a really nice way to use this. Um, I think that putting more on top of it might make it a little bit overwhelming. Um, as you can see, they're already a pretty bold pair of shoes as it is. I'd also mentioned about fish skin sometimes having a little metallic finish on it and I couldn't resist pulling out these beautiful gold and orange shoes. Now if we get right up close to these you can see that we've got that beautiful sort of fiery coral orange colour underneath and then it's got a sheen of gold over the top and they truly are just such a spectacular colour to wear. Now one more thing that I wanted to share with you, fish skin is actually quite a small material as you might expect. So when we're putting together the patterns for these materials, you might find a couple of extra seams in your shoes that you may not be expecting. So you can see through the toe here, we've got an extra seam here and an extra one here. And through the sides of the shoes, there's extra seams here as well. And it's just something worth being aware of. They're very neat, so you're not really going to see them, but one to know about if you're going to be designing with fish skin. So if you love the idea of fish skin, but you're just not quite sure, you can actually order swatches of these materials from us. I've put the link below, all you need to do is click on that, pick your materials and we'll whisk them to you as quickly as we can. I've also put below links to the three designs that I've shared with you today so that you've got a starting point for your very own perfect fish skin shoe design. But if you'd like to do something that's just completely from scratch, feel free to go to our designer and you can start off your very own fish skin design from a blank page. I really hope you enjoy designing with our fish skin, it's textural, it's wonderful and a lot of fun.